My name is Mabel Mungomba. I am a professional marketer. By way of background, my career starts by me graduating from the University of Zambia uh, with a bachelor's in business administration. Beyond that, I did several postgraduate studies, and one of them is the Chartered Institute of Marketing. And that is the career that has taken me into industry, helped me to open many doors. And what I find is that even where I have been a CEO in more than three organizations, the competences that a career in marketing has given me seems to be the ones that are loudest in my career. So after my long, illustrious career of 25 years in marketing, I decided to set up a company that I co-founded, which does marketing services and consultancy. So as I have been, especially after the COVID uh, period, I began to see that digital big technology started taking over the landscape. And even in marketing, I started seeing that people suffered a lot when we couldn't go out and use the traditional means of selling, traditional means of communicating, traditional means of marketing and product support, even customer service. It was so hard to be face to face. So the customer facing concept that we had preached began to wane off and the digital concept seemed to be the only option that we had. So for a consultant like me, I began to see that I needed to be more relevant to this new world that was unfolding before me. Then I saw Zambia Institute of Marketing advertise that they were going to run a digital course. I knew to be relevant to the new world, I needed to jump at the opportunity. The course itself was not long. So it was 12 weeks of learning. But what was beautiful is that we were learning digitally. So we were doing online learning. And when we, we, we needed support, we had online tools and share points where we could access our support material. So for 12 weeks, we were in class. By design, the specific skills and knowledge that I learned came from the idea that the whole course content was based on digital uh, ways of doing things. The whole content was also based on competences that are required for you to be able to know how to utilize digital marketing tools and therefore what I think is that just by the design of it, there was content that went to every aspect of digital marketing. In addition, one of the skills that I was really, really amazed at and found valuable was data analytics. So we learned many concepts around data analytics, whether we were analyzing data in product support, or we were analyzing data in research, so we were analyzing data in advertising. That course provides all those landscapes. And what I find is that there were always opportunities for conversation, for specifics that were maybe very um, uh, specific to a particular area of marketing. The facilitators would always give us additional learning to ensure that everyone who was on that course actually got something they can use. From my personal business side, I've had to change the way I do things in the business. I have found that I'm doing a lot of evidence-based analytics for myself. And then I also find that it's cheaper, actually. Or maybe instead of using the word cheaper, I should say I found it more cost-effective than the traditional tools that we have used over the years. From a client-facing side, I have found that when you use digital, you don't need to go and see the client. You give them a full experience using digital tools. Even graphic design has become something that I would never have thought I can do on my own. So my presentations are that much better using the digital uh, marketing tools that we were exposed to. 
on the client side as well, I found that it's easier for me to advise them how to move away from the traditional funnels of working, whether it's marketing funnel or a sales funnel or a customer service funnel, where we had seven steps to convince a client. The digital tool only has three steps. In terms of reach, where I was reaching 10,000 clients, using digital tools gives me a limitless blue ocean where I can see even 3 million likes in just one click. So if you're comparing, there's not much to compare. This is an imperative for every marketer. Uh, as you know, the Zambia Institute of Marketing is a professional association. So for this course, because they were teaching us skills and competencies, the Institute went out to look for a like-minded partner. And they went and found a university in Cyprus called Hellenic American Union. So it means that whatever we were learning is coming from academia meaning it is proven and it is something that at the end we got a qualification certificate for. Um, and I think for that, I have to commend the Zambia Institute of Marketing because I can display my certificate and people are believable because they know that whatever I'm talking about has a backing of proper academia from a university. I feel like it has changed my life. So I think a lot of times marketers are criticized for not providing evidence-based tools for the things that they do, whether from a consultancy perspective or from a practice perspective. So I would just advise everybody who has been practicing marketing for more than five years, that whatever you learned is no longer relevant to this new world that's unfolding before us. And what a way to get valuable and very deep learning from a university than going through the opportunities that Zambia Institute of Marketing gives. So if you are a marketer sitting in your office feeling like you are no longer relevant to this world, it's because the world is changing. And next time you see an advert which says the digital marketing course is coming round, it's an imperative. So get up and sign up and see you in the next class.